guys in this video tutorial I'll be showing you how to create custom iPhone style icon and to make it say whatever you want to say and as you can see I custom created this one to say MTM for Mac Tech Man so to start off you're gonna need an App Store icon as you probably have guessed App Store icon so here's a good size 140 by 138 pixels and just drag it to your desktop because that's all we'll need that size because already this is bigger than the YouTube profile icon so we are going to open this um, app store icon that we just downloaded to in preview just to make it easier um, and just command all command a select it all and then copy it and I've already done that so oh wait no just open it in preview like this command A command C to copy it and now you can trash it open Photoshop and create a new document and as you can see it has uh, okay it's supposed it's adjusted to our settings the size yeah so just click OK and now just paste it in and there we go so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna modify this you don't need to have it this big <laughs> um, so yeah now we're going to take an eyedropper tool or the eyedropper tool and um, adjust it to a darker tone so this is about good and just see over here when you drag it along what's what's the darkest part and it's around here so now we're going to take, uh, first of all, make a new layer and use the brush tool and just go around the whole thing, the whole top half of the circle. And try to make it as good as you can. So, I'm just going to make this bigger so it'll go faster. And, so yeah, there's the top half. Now we're going to take the eyedropper tool and go somewhere around here. That's a good, and just adjust this. That's good. So, Actually, I'll make it a little brighter. Okay. So now we're just going to take the brush tool, and you can create a new layer if you want, but I'm not going to because I don't, you don't need to. Um, yeah. So now just take, oh, that's way too bright. Still. You can see you have to adjust this a little bit. So that's about good. Just drag it across the top half. Try to make it as even and straight as you can. Okay. And just go around the whole bottom half. And you can adjust the brush size so you can get in smaller cracks. Why did I do that? And just try to make it look as good as you can. Because the better, more time you put into it, the better it'll look. So, think about that. And it doesn't matter if it like goes out of the circle. You can just erase this with the eraser tool or just a white paintbrush so as you can see this looks pretty good but we're not done because we still need to add text or whatever you want to add like a picture or something maybe so go over here to the text tool and 
click in the center and I'm gonna type MTM for Mac Techman obviously and make the color white so it matches the outside of the circle and that looks pretty good and I found that the best font size was 32 for this and or no, whatever font size makes it so it like um, touches the outside of the circle that looks the best in my opinion and the best font is Arial Black because if you make it like another one it doesn't look so good like come on but I think Arial Black looks the best in my opinion so yeah there is your finished product so as you can see that is what we started with and that is what we have now so th thanks sorry for that thanks for watching Mac Tech Man and please rate comment and subscribe and thanks for watching